Um... I should definitely get a kill with me, I mean, but the question is, which one? I guess this one. Okay, how's Niemia's first level up gonna look? Eh. You know, not really a big fan of luck. <laughs> uh, luck's one of those stats that I just really can't get behind too much. Luck's nice because it does negate critical hit chance, but uh, still, not a fan. <laughs> I, I could do without it, honestly. Wow. This this is kind of annoying that I can't actually hit that from here. Uh, I'll have a few units who will be able to attack it next turn, but still... Kind of a pain. Okay. Did anyone gain any stats? Missing health? Anything? No? Molder, I guess you're just, uh, not doing anything again. Just kind of sit back and start drinking a Coke or something. Cokes existed back in the days of Fire Emblem, right? I hope so. It'll give Molder something to do. Oh, hi! Oh, my! Those travelers besieged by the arts of evil. Ha <laughs> ha! Right you are, Lady Alarachelle! I cannot allow this to happen. Come! We must charge down these cliffs and rush to their aid. We charge down these cliffs and the only thing we'll be rushing off to is death. How about we find us a nice gentle path down, hmm? Ah, yes. Well, let us hurry nonetheless. I simply cannot abide those wicked beasts running amok. Okay, then. <laughs> that was uh, definitely strange, but I'll take it. Uh, Archer, let's keep your rampage going, I suppose. You're doing really good work. You'll probably take a hit here, but at least Mulder will have something to do. Okay, his first level up. Eh, these level ups are not great. <laughs> They're really, really not. Okay, let's see. You know what? I'm going to do this. I'm going to hit this guy with Gilliam. Him getting experience, I think, kind of takes priority over Vanessa right now. This way I can kind of attack from a distance with the Javelin. Get some nice little pot shots in. Okay, now we have this to worry about. Uh, I want to get you down there, obviously. Oh, yeah, I could actually heal you. You're not really that hurt, but... Again, Mulder's doing something. <laughs> That's mainly what I'm concerned with right now. Also, yeah, he's probably going to attack Archer, but that's fine. Okay, let's... I should have done this a little better. Not gonna matter too much though, I suppose. One thing that's kind of interesting about the uh, bone lockers, and I'll definitely showcase it in a second, is um. They have the capabilities. Actually, they don't. Maybe I'm thinking of their promoted class. But it's kind of weird. I feel like, in some ways, Bone Walkers can actually have the ability to use all weapons of the triangle. But for some reason, they only use swords and lances. For some reason. But again, like, I mean, maybe it was like the player's guide I had that said that. I don't really know for sure anymore. It's been so long since I've played this, actually. Last time I played it was probably when it came out for the Ambassador program back in the day for the 3DS. 
Oh, this could actually be problematic. Because if... Yeah, if he keeps killing these guys, he's dead. Okay, good. Huh. <sighs> Thank God he avoided that. And yeah, I forgot that one guy was weak, so I'll be fine. Ooh, that hurt. Either way, he's still alive. That's all that matters. Boom. Look at how huge that lance is compared to the size of that guy's body. It's like, oh my god, could you do any more damage? Okay, so now I have to deal with these guys. Um, I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to... Well, I'm definitely going to bring Erica back for sure. I wonder if she'll actually be able to... She has 11 speed. Oh, these guys have zero speed. So yeah, she'll be able to double with the steel sword. But I'm still going to use the iron sword, though, because I don't want her to kill these guys. I actually do not want that to happen, because I want to actually grind some experience out for these guys, too. Man. Oh, there's a forest there. That's why I was like, wow. Franz is not doing very well for me in the movement department. <laughs> but no, that's, again, just the terrain. Okay. I'll put you right here. Also, yes, let's heal Archer before he dies. We do not want him to die on us. So far, he's been actually very, very helpful, so... Uh, can you actually do stuff without killing? Not really, but you have good resistance, I guess. Yeah, you can kill this guy. Yay, Vanessa actually killed something for once. And then there's actually her first kill. Take care of that guy with Gilliam. He's going to get a level up. Let me guess. HP, strength, defense. Wow! <laughs> I was actually just guessing. I mean that's traditional what he what traditionally is highest growths, but still, <laughs> still surprised I called that. Oh, beautiful! That's a beautiful level up. Good job, Artor. Very well done. Oh wow, they're actually moving in a very weird pattern here. So one thing I'm gonna do before I attack this turn, is I want to see how much damage these guys can do to Ross just with their bare claws. So I might put Ross in as a defense against, or a defense for Niemi. Since I think he will be fine. But I'll make sure before I actually do it. Because the last thing I want to do is kill a young kid. Especially one with such promise. Maybe he hasn't been showing it as much as he could, but he definitely has some promise. We just gotta pull it out of him. Okay. Boom. You know, Franz hasn't gotten a level up in a while. Let's see how his next level up goes. Better, way better. I, I can I can get behind that a little bit. Okay, first of all, let's save this village. Hmm? Your flesh shows no signs of putrefaction. It seems you're not a revenant. I've decided to join you in a battle now. My name is Loot. I'm a mage of superior wisdom and rare ability. I've been reading up on these revenants. They are, quite simply, no match for me. I am superior, after all. Okay. I will uh, take your word for it. And we really should, because Loot, I think, is one of the best characters in the game. Very, very, very powerful mage unit. 
She is definitely great. She's awesome. She's level 1, and she can double units very easily. And she's very, very powerful, too. Female sages have a knack for being, like, really, really powerful in Fire Emblem games, I've noticed. So, uh... Yeah, definitely give them credit where credit is due, because they can mop the floor with you. That rhymed, and I did not mean for that to rhyme. <laughs> okay, heal up our tour. We'll actually have some good experience for Mulder in this level. The only problem is, uh, we're kind of running low on our heal staff a little bit. We probably won't need that much, though, so we should still be okay. Okay, let's go ahead and use this guy again. We've cleared the bridge of the revenants. But now we have the deal with these guys. Let's see. If we attack straight up, they'll do 5 damage, which is not too much. And if we're in the forest, it'll even do less damage. Okay, this is actually going to be pretty good, I feel like. Hell, even if I go to the mountains, that's not too bad either. Yeah, let's do it. I think we'll be fine. Stupid frickin' revenants. Die to my sword. And then... Oh, shoot. I didn't plan this as well as I intended to. Actually... How should I do this? Oh, I know what I can do. This works as well. Gonna continue to keep Niemi at a distance. Because she is an archer, after all. And that is the smart thing to do. I should give him another... Oh, not quite. He'll get attacked here, though, and that will give him another level up, so... That's alright. Go ahead and get things moving. Uh, I think he'd still go after Colm, but I'll still put him out of range just in case. Go, Erica! Weaken your foes! I hate that I u I'm using here for weakening enemies as opposed to destroying enemies, but... Welcome to the world of Fire Emblem, where sometimes that's going to be the case. That's just the way it is. Okay. Let's go ahead and bring over... Actually, will Loot be able to... Okay, yeah, she can. Of course she can. Now, I'm not sure about this final guy. I feel like the final guy does move if you get into his range, but I'm not really sure... Because he's a boss, he might not. So again, I'm just not really that sure. Doesn't really need it, but whatever. We'll give him some healing. Anything to give Mulder something to do. How did... Oh, this guy just didn't attack for some reason. That's really weird. Normal, well, uh, no, I guess the monster's AI is programmed to sometimes not attack. It's really weird. I mean, I, I kind of get it because they're monsters, they're brain dead, they're, come on, they're basically zombies. I guess it does make a little bit of sense, but still. Okay, more experience. Give me all your experience. Give me all the experience you can muster. When I was young, I thought the... Ex oh my god, Ross! Thank you for that. Finally showing that you get great level ups. I knew you could. I knew I wasn't lying when I said that. It was just the RNG, random number generation generator gods who were... Uh, playing tricks on me, I suppose. I'm not going to put you in danger, Vanessa. Definitely not, because you could die very easily. 
just put you right here. And we'll see. Oh, wow, you're, you're damaged too. I feel like all my units are damaged except these guys who've been fending off. Just <laughs> that horde of zombies just coming from the back. Okay, he does move. Okay, that's fine. He can move. I don't have a problem with him moving. And yeah, look at how much HP he has. He's basically the warrior equivalent of the uh, monsters, I guess. But now we have to defeat this guy. The only question with is with who? Or with whom? Well, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get... I don't want her getting the kill, though. That's the only thing. Well, regardless, I'll heal first. Because I'd honestly rather get the kill with the loot than I would with Vanessa. Yeah, let's go for it. I believe I can fire. <laughs> I believe I can set you on fire. I'll think about it every night and day. Oh, look, you burned away. Decent level up. <laughs> okay. We've killed all the monsters. Still, we'd best burn the bones to ash to be sure they don't return. I still can't believe we've been fighting here. I thought those fiends nothing more than myth and legend. Those revenants are said to be the least of the dark creatures. And yet the weakest of them could outmatch any normal man. We cannot take this enemy lightly. Oh yes, there are much worse than those revenants and the entombed. Let's see, there's the Bone Walkers, Moth Dogs, Gargoyles, Bales. Why, I'll bet you just about any creature of lore could be wa walking again. Yes, we're in for some trouble. Even my fabulous power may not be enough. Oh, Divine Light, show me. Is this a sign of dark days to come? By all that's holy, what is happening? Princess Erica, perhaps it would be wise to return to Freelia and regroup. Pressing forward seems foolish in light of recent events. We cannot face both Grotto's forces and more of these terrible things. Seth, I follow your point, and nothing would please me more than running for safety. But what of my brother? He and his men are trapped in the same situation we are. I know full well that I may be leading us into an even greater danger, but... Please, try to understand. I do, my princess, and I vow to see you through this safely. Oh, hi guys. Aha! Foul creatures, beware! I, a la Rochelle, bestow upon you the honor of banishment at my blessed hands. Oh? Where are the monsters? Well, we just finished. Ah, glad tidings indeed. The heavens must be rejoicing. I am a tad disappointed, however. After all, I did rush all the way here to show you the splendor of my might. Gwahaha! <laughs> it's a real shame, innit, Lady Arachelle? What shameful is the way you drag us around the countryside. Pardon me, but who are you? Me? Since you ask, please allow me to introduce myself. It is I, the true light and glory of the sacred realm of Rouston. Stop! Lady Alarchelle, you mustn't continue. You cannot reveal your true identity here. Oh, yes, you're right. Oh, I get so careless sometimes. Now I must ride off in anonymity. Oh, how beautifully romantic! Uh, right. Fare thee well, strangers. Perhaps our paths will cross again. Come, Dazla, Renak, we ride. Quahaha! <laughs> Let's go, Renak! Alright, alright. What was that about? Yeah, those guys are weird. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and stop this recording session here. I hope you guys have been enjoying, been enjoying the first, uh... Two and a half hours of Fire Emblem Sacred Stones, and I'll see you guys next time when we start Chapter 5. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time. Later, folks.